the tape. The Floyd Mayweather and Ricky Hatton. A one-year age advantage. Morales in 2001. Floyd Mayweather has generally been considered the best pound-for-pound -pound fighter in the sport. Could be. Does he have enough experience against top-notch opposition for this? Hatton points. Ricky Hatton enters to the strains of Blue Moon, which is the traditional theme song of the... playing a Floyd Mayweather video to the crowd, unless they come on a butt. And here's Floyd Mayweather with that brilliant record. 17 straight wins, eight knockouts. In let's go to Michael Buffer for the official introduction. Uh, let's get ready to rumble. Ricky. Gentlemen, we don't lose in the dressing room. I expect a good, clean fight. All the time. And remember, guys, I'm fair, but I'm firm. Touch him up. If you like watching Floyd Mayweather fight, feast your eyes. He flatly claimed 2009 that this will be, if not his last fight, I think. Hatton would never say anything of the sort. Right here, you see the difference in the speed of Ricky Hatton as compared to other opponents. Left hook lands on the button for Mayweather. So far, Mayweather is doing a very good job of keeping the, the foot specials is amazing. So. Every body a thunderous roar from the crowd, or at least as long as Hatton is functionally in the fight. See, that's again that foot speed faster than he wants to. And if Floyd wasn't such a gifted... Try to land something serious. So far, I would say the fight is going more towards what Ricky wants to do. Seconds of every round. Very few opponents who are in love with that. It's the oh, British oh, 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 with Another effective, accurate counterpart. That's what Floyd is going to have to do to get some respect, because he can't yeah. jump. Slippy streets, slippy streets, yeah? They go crazy, yeah? What's that fun for you? Three rounds. Oh, that hold it. Shit. Many fans around the arena. He's landed, I'd have to say, Floyd. The, ring, the fight is moving towards the way Ricky wants it to go. A so he's, he's, he's actually yeah, yeah. controlling it. There's an abrasion on the left cheekbone. I thought I saw a trickle of blood out of the nostril of Ricky Hatton. Cortez with a tutorial. Well, when you're coming in with the anxiety and the way that Ricky's coming in, you're always going to leave yourself open. So he's determined whether by taking, but still taking punches as he's coming in. Good right hand by Mayweather. And then he reached out. Well, so far, he's, he's keeping Ricky at a distance where he can catch him. But if, if he, he lets Ricky start crying, then there's a fight. Now Hatton lands very, with very jab and gets inside. You gotta get another jab, almost hit. It's Mayweather who's holding, used to clinching and holding in the back. Now wraps an arm under Mayweather's left arm. And head more head movement. I like to keep it on him, you've got to keep it on him. It's simple for now, simple for now. Like you said, like you're not going to look back. Roger just said exactly what I'd said. That's what he's doing, this pot shot. He's landing clean punches and then... Which has been his probably his most effective punch tonight. 
And he's been getting away with that a lot. He lands it and then he moves right in and smothers his opponent after that. Six out of 30. Mayweather landing at a 33% rate. Hatton landing at a 20% rate. Neither man throwing. Two rats to one Ricky Hatton. And that's what bothers me about Floyd Mayweather is Eric right. pushing in Don't and landed good shots on the inside. And Mayweather's Don't not giving us any lateral Don't movement. The reason Two to for one. The, is that Hatton's eye has not opened up again yet. Mayweather, or Hatton's head back, just like that. Accurate, which is he has to do tonight. He, he's got to. Rick is making him have to fight. This is definitely not dancing with the stars. I think it's turned out to be a very good round for Floyd Mayweather because he withstood the challenge of the first minute of the round. And now Hatton will have a lot to think about as he goes back to his corner. He got punished. Hey, hey, hey. If you can't get anything, defuse the situation. Do you understand? There you see Ricky Hatton so anxious to come in forward, not moving his head as much as he should, and Floyd is pinpointing all of his Hold shots. Up. And he can make it into the late round. Mayweather is still a young, a relatively young. Most of the work in the round has been done by Huge round leads. He's got Hatton in big trouble. Hatton gets a chance to land a right hand in return. It's an assault, and it was brilliant stuff. Now Hatton shows he's not done yet. But the difference is Rick is not landing anything effectively clean. Yeah, you You're breaking that hole down. It's okay. Silly fighting about that. Yeah. Listen. Listen. Okay. Right back to as soon as he starts over. Yep, I say it right there. Okay. Even though Ricky was aggressive and mauling him, he never was landing the clean effect of punches the way that Floyd is. He's connected against him. Floyd Mayweather has by far the most positive plus minus rating. Huge difference between Mayweather's connect percentage and the percentage of punches landed against him, and you're seeing it. Floyd, very intelligent fighter. He will study him, and once he sees he's slowing down, he would take advantage of him, maybe stop him as the fight goes in effect with the There's still a little package. Floyd Mayweather begins to use his jab, a weapon we don't see all that often. But you say, look how easy this is. Somebody here is there, get some room to move. Get some room to punch. Don't do it this next two rounds. Don't do it. Floyd Mayweather unveiled his jab in round nine and landed 11 of 15 of them. Three, one even, 86, 84, Floyd Mayweather. In case you're wondering about the indomitability, 43 wins, no losses coming in. They can spot your strike for the career. Check the left hook. A check left hook. What a perfect shot. The left hook by Mayweather and... Yeah. He's got a shaky leg. He's got to buy time here. Well, he's not the type of fighter that knows how. Every situation for Hatton. This fight is over. Uh, a fighter he's never been confronted with before. And it brought the best out of him. He stayed and closed the show. A brilliant performance once again. Hatton's triumph tonight is that he forced Mayweather to answer Here down you the see stretch. the check left hook as he was coming in. He caught him with the left hook, as he, but which he's been hitting with quite often tonight. That punch and the right hand lead have been very consistent. Hatton going head first into the ring post. Oh, which is, plus, I think he was getting a little fatigued at that stage. And then this is the end. Another flush left hook. Hooks. Very accurate punches. He's a tremendously accurate puncher. Saw it again tonight. Never has it been more clear who's the money. money.